In this guide, I'll show you how to download and install the VLC Media Player on Windows 11. So the first thing you want to do is open up your web browser and go to Google. Then in search, you want to type in VLC Media Player and you can select VLC Media Player Download. Then you want to scroll down on this page until you get to videoland.org and we're going to select the top link. From here, you'll see the option to download VLC, but if you select the drop down arrow, you can select your specific operating system. So for me, it's going to be Windows 64 bit, so I'm going to click on it. And then you just want to wait for the download to begin. And if it doesn't start in a few seconds, just simply click here. So once this window pops up, you want to select your desktop and then you want to save the application file there. Once that's finished, you want to go to your desktop and double click on the VLC installer. And then you want to select your language. I'm going to leave it on English. And then you want to press next on this page. And here is going to be the license agreement, which you can read through if you'd like. I'm just going to press next. So select next at the bottom and you want to press install once more here, and then it's going to begin installing. Now, once that's finished, you'll have the ability to run it immediately, and you'll also see a shortcut that will appear for the program. Now, if you have a video file or photo you want to open up with VLC, all you have to do is right click on the file, and then what you want to do is select open with and go to choose another app. Then if you scroll down, you should be able to find the VLC media player, and you can click on it once, and you can open it that way just once, or you can select always. Now, once you open up VLC for the first time, you'll see in the bottom left corner, you have a bunch of different controls you can learn how to use with the program. On the bottom right corner, you'll have your volume setting. And then in the top left corner, you have a bunch of different options here to customize your experience. If this guide was helpful, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.